Okay, so this is where things get interesting. Areas contain smugglers' caches, which are guarded. All must be opened to claim the reward. All non-unique equipment is drops as currency instead. Great. Contains three additional packs of four map bosses. So we'll have 13 map bosses instead of one. Players do not gain experience. Rare monsters have three additional modifiers. Maximum number of players is one. Need to make sure to like clear as best I can. And remember that rare monsters can just like kill me very quickly because of their extra mods. Also, there's going to be a pack of map bosses. There's going to be three packs of map bosses somewhere. But be kind of careful that I when I run into them. Come on, Forg. Stay with me and stay safe. You must stay close, because this place is scary and things might step on you. Oh, there's a map boss. That is the map boss from Race Course. Oh, who's that? Is that Dresso? Master of something. Well. Oh, oh god, the Brian King's here! <laughs> The Sar Lion of the Seas. Oriath Virtue. Okay, so there was another boss there too that I I don't really know which one that was. Ooh. Oriath Virtue, whoever you are. Oh, that's the promenade boss. The map boss combos can be bad, but this is a good boss killer with the fact that I can armor freeze a lot of shit pretty easily. So, I just need to get rid of the adds, mostly. And then I can permafreeze a lot of shit. Oh! Did I just see Kaduku? Wait, who's that? Sanctum Enforcer. Oh, that's the Ivory Temple boss. Oh. Come on. Is that the Minotaur from this course? I think so. Nope! Nope. That one nasty's over there. Oh, it's the Blasphemer. The heavy curse guy. Be careful with him. Okay, that should be four bosses. There should be another pack of bosses, though. I haven't seen yet. There's Poporo from Hole. This might be my first successful Valdos. Don't don't wanna. I don't want to jinx anything, but this might be my first successful old Baldur's. Oh, fuck, it's the goddess Unchained. I hate her. Fucking orchard boss. Oh no, it's the explody guy. From the dig, not dig. From the, uh, like, the other underground map. Nope! Explosion. That was more dangerous in its actual map, though, because you're in a contained area. Nope. I have to deal with the goddess still. The goddess is my biggest concern, because she is the scariest. Thankfully, there's a lot of trees to break the line of sight if I need to. Is that Mervale? Yep, that's Mervale. Oh, she teleported. You're gonna have some trouble. There you go. Okay, that's the goddess down. Norvale should still be over here, though. Yep, there she is. And I'm gonna get lasered in a second. Yep, there's the laser. Oh, she's focused on the totems. Okay, that's good. Oh, she's focused on the totems. There we go. I think that's from Primordial Pools, technically, but it is Marvale. Just a different version. Okay, I see smugglers' caches coming up, so those will be guarded. Don't know by what. So they're basically strong boxes now. I'll clear the area first. Okay, I should be fine now. I can just comfortably go and deal with these. Open and jump. Who is that? Oh, so these are the unique mobs that are from like, actually in the, uh, heist themselves. That's cool to see them in maps. 
Uh, I'm gonna set up my totems in advance this time. Yeah, that worked way better. Okay, I think I'm on the home stretch now. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, that's it. Our first Falls puzzle box complete. A foil ivory tower. Oh my gosh, it looks like there's... It's sparkling like there's stars on it. That's so pretty. Oh, that's gorgeous. That is so pretty. That has got to be like one of the prettier Voidborn relics. And I really like the Voidborn stuff too. Hey, you got this far in the video. Thank you so much. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. If you want to see uh, this content in its uncut form, we have our other channel, at Black Cat Streams, in the description. And if you want to see us live, uh, come join us on Twitch, also in the description. Thank you so much. Hope to see you in the next video.